Hey everybody, <laughs> hey, we're live. We are live from the Westminster location, and I am John with Great Moments, and here is Josh gonna help me out tonight, What's and up, guys? Stat Boy is over there. He's gonna look up some stats for us if needed. If needed. Got another baseball mystery box. They never disappoint. Someone's gonna get a Mickey Mantle autographed baseball with a full JSA letter for $99 tonight. There's John and Scott. What's up, guys? Everybody join in, we got a few minutes. Uh, mystery boxes. You can get your mystery box at greatmomentsportscards.com. We got some new people this time. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Is Mike Jack new? Is new. Christopher's new. How about Mike? Mike, I've not seen on the Mike, mystery box. Mike Kehoe. Yeah. Box number one. Could yeah. be new, right? We have, um, yeah. Uh, Christopher, Christopher no. I'll let you do that one. Yeah. <laughs> Chris, I hope you're watching. What is it? Voxacus? If it's systematic? I don't Voxacus? know. Voxacus? Yeah. Okay. Brandon Black. I Brandon Black. Yep. 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 And Paul and Joe Morgan. How about Black Vincent are, Brooks? Are how about stars, Vincent? Blake and Kevin. Oh, Dan. Dan. Hey, Dan. Dan how you Dan. been? Yeah, Vincent Blast Brooks from the past, past, right? Dan Durr? Yeah. Okay. Lisa. Yep. Cool. And then we have. So then our all stars. Yeah, yeah. Blake and Matt. And Kevin. Yeah, and yeah. Chuck. Chuck. I think Chuck won our last two. I think Chuck Joe, closed us out. Uh, yep. You, uh, Joe Morgan. John Word. All right, Jonathan. Did you say Jonathan or did I? I did. Okay. Yeah, All he's right. One of our Paul. 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 Oh, yeah. All right. Uh, so again, you can get your stuff. Great Moment Sports Cards .com is where you can get your mystery box. What's up, Mr. Word? Um, at some point, I, some point, someday, usually I don't know when it is, but I will post on Facebook mystery box announcement coming soon. Usually means the next day we'll post a video and we'll talk about the theme of the mystery box. And as we're talking about it, you run to greatmomentsportscards.com and purchase your mystery box because they do sell out pretty quick. Um, got a really good one coming up. Do a we? Really good one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm not gonna say what it is, but hey it's there, a big cat. It's a good one. <laughs> right. Uh, Bob. Bob is a little slow moving tonight. A little he's tired. Little, he's tired. Got up at five. Got up since five. Been up since five. Yeah. Right. Up with the sun. Mm -hmm. Well, before the sun. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll take your word for it. I don't know what 5 a.m. looks like. No. I do. I, I wake up at 5 sometimes. I used to stay up till 5. Don't stay no, up no, running. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. I've, I have taken off from running. I've been on a work binge for like two to three weeks. I haven't ran in like... No, okay. I ran the sun, the Saturday we were in Chantilly is the last time I ran. Man, that's a lot. It is. Yeah. It is. It is. So, getting lazy over here. I am getting lazy. So I'm, I'm a, my goal is to get back Sunday and uh, just hit it Sunday and yeah. then start fresh. But we had so much happen in here. I, I, you know, yeah. I wanted to get in here as early as possible every day. Yeah. We had that. Well, what's part of the next mystery box? 375 pieces of memorabilia came in. Yeah. Right this week. Yeah. Not to mention a collection of 170 baseballs and 70 bats that we purchased. Right. Yeah, we got PSA action happening. We got a lot going We're on. expecting a couple packages from PSA coming, back this week. coming. Oh yeah. yeah, and I think the one that's coming back is the one we've been waiting for since the national. That's terrific. The, the 25 day of, uh, turnaround that took 50 plus. Days. That took 50 plus and days. We got two bulk orders back before that one. Yes. <laughs> you hear that, and, Mr. Word? They're coming. Yes. <laughs> They're coming and we down. handed in an order on 9:24 that we're gonna have back. It looks like tomorrow. 924 in the, at, the, at the Philly 15. show I handed that one in from mid and it, right but the one from no the one from August 6th or early August huh? at the, the national is not back yet right. but the the 25 day order but the 65 day order from 924 a so month and a half later right. is coming back I guess that's PSA literally holds the cards Right? Yeah. yeah they I hold like all that. the cards. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. You like that? Yeah, okay. Good. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um, yeah, we'll give another minute. We got two going. Two minutes. How many people are watching? We got anybody viewing? Anybody, anybody out there watching? If you, okay. A little light tonight. Uh, you would think with all the newbies, I mean, think everybody would be watching. You know, you got Chuck has two. You got Jonathan's got two. Two or three. Mm -hmm. got two. Oh, there's Bob. Oh, wait a minute. There's, that's our Bob. Don right? has two. That's our Bob. I knew that Bob. I knew. I know. 
Tupperware over there. Mm -hmm. about 15 mm -hmm. so we definitely got more watchers than we have people. Okay. So All right. I think that means we're safe to begin. All right. So, uh, box number one. Mike Kehoe. Mike Kehoe. Box number one. Let's rip this puppy open. Box number one. Kind of nice leader package. Oh, look at that. Did wow. Did Dave do these? Wow. Man, I told you. Wow. <laughs> Box number one is a Paul Molitor with an HOF inscription. HOF 04, Paul Molitor. Paul Molitor. Paul Molitor, World Series MVP and Hall of Famer. Goes to uh, Mike. Mike Kehoe. Box number one, Paul Molitor. Box number two yeah, is yeah. Chuck Gillis. And boy, did Perry Hall step up. Yeah. Perry Hall did. We had eight, eight boxes yes. going back to Perry Hall. Perry Hall rose to the occasion. All right, Chuck, see what you get, buddy. Your um, ball will be at Perry Hall waiting. And box number... Oh, very nice. Earl Weaver, Manager of the Year, 1979. Very cool ball. There, there you go. That's Chuck. a great, yeah, good there ball, go. Chuck. Earl hey, Weaver with the inscription. The Manager of the Year, 1979. Thank you very much, Chuck. Um, so not to give too much away, Josh, but we don't want people stalking you. Where are you going? Uh, Virginia, Shenandoah area, town oh. called McGahee'sville. McGahee'sville. Where Willis is the mayor. Willis is the mayor. I hope so. I mean, that'd be I'll have fun. fun that'd be fun. I know. <laughs> All right. Willis is there with a bottle um, of candy. So yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's how Willis rolls. All right, Kevin. Box number three. So what do you do in? What do you do there? Nothing. As little as possible. Okay. That's what the plan is, but the kids are coming, so we're gonna nice. go to a water park one day. Mm-hmm. Or there, is there any kayaking in the plan? Um, maybe it's, or it's a possibility. Is there it's a lake? The is there a lake that There's you can kids. go out on? Yeah. All right, Kevin. A little bit of hiking, a little bit of sitting around a fire. Mm-hmm. Watching a fire burn. It, are, now, are you a staying? Stump burning. Are you staying in a hotel or your tent? Airbnb you? house. A nice house. Nice. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right, Kevin. Box number three. What's up, Mike? And box A. Hey, Mike. Box number three. Yeah, if anybody wants to come to McGahee'sville, give me a holler. <laughs> Is um oh that does look pretty cool. When this is, now we've went back and forth on how to pronounce it. Red show and dice. I'm gonna go with you. I'm That's gonna, what I'm, I'm going gonna, with. Uh, Red show and dice. There's an N before the SP. That's a silent N. It's got to be. <laughs> red. Otherwise, it's dice. red show and dice. 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 <laughs> dice. That's possible. Red show and yeah. dice. Yeah. We'll go with that. Yeah. All right. Very nice. Hey, Very difficult. Kevin. Right. Was Bob. That Was that Kevin? Bob. Yes. Okay. Um, Bob. Yes. Red show and dice. Yes. He's looking. Is he alive? I would doubt that he is. Uh, he was born in 1923. Okay. So if so, so, if so he's 96. 96. Uh, June 6, 2018. Oh, okay. All right, Josh. Here's your uh, your name right Christopher here. Christopher V. Christopher V. There we go. Box Let's number go four. Good luck. Box number four. Christopher V. There you go. Look at that. That's a good wrap. That's there. a good wrap. Who did this? Um, Box number four goes to Chris. And very Dennis Eckersley, Hall of Fame, 2004, one of my favorites. What's up, Scott? Bro? Dennis, I like the autograph. Yeah. I really do like the right, autograph. We're going to go back one real quick. Shane Deanst is how it's pronounced. Shane Deanst. Shane Deanst. I was way off. Yeah, that's okay. Shane Deanst. That's all right. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Scott. Hey, Cole. There's Cole. Yeah, what's up, Cole? Dennis Eckersley. So... Congrats on the new girlfriend, Cole. Yeah, congratulations, <laughs> Cole. Um... One of the reasons I like Eckersley is not only was he very animated on the mound. Remember, he'd point at you after he uh, struck you out, yeah, like when he would me. close it out. He never struck me out. It never he struck me. Yeah, right. As much as he tried. Um, 
But one yeah, of the one of the things yeah, I like you know, is he he tells he tells the story. He's so. very good at telling the story about when Kirk gets and hit the home run off of him, mm -hmm. and he's a great sport about it. And I've seen interviews with him, and he's like he's so good that he doesn't mind talking about his failures. You know what I mean? He's so confident, right? So he sits there and he's like, "Yeah, I just I couldn't believe I couldn't believe he hit that." I mean, it's like I gave him, you know. Like back, he made a good pitch. Yeah, I, I, I gave him a backdoor slider, you know, and he just yeah. took me deep or something like that. Yeah. It's pretty cool listening to him, you know. Who are we talking about? Fame Deans? Oh, it has to be. No. Right, so we're in box number <laughs> five. So that's why, that's, that's why I like Dennis Aguilar. Not to mention I sat in the back room of Chantilly for like a half an hour talking to him one day. Yeah. So he's very laid back, very nice guy. Mm -hmm. um, okay. Jonathan? Mm-hmm. You let Dave do some of these? Or? I think I did. <laughs> um, okay, so this is uh, Tom Glavin. Tom Glavin. So I guess, okay, if you're talking about pitching rotations, One of the best you had Palmer, McNally, Cuellar, yeah. and Dobson, the 420 game winners. But you had Schmoltz, Avery, I mean Schmoltz, Glavin, and Maddox. And Avery. Yeah, Avery yeah, early on. None of those guys, they didn't. You know, four guys went 20. No, mm -mm, no, well, they were good pitchers. I yeah, mean, they, they were good. really good pitchers. Really good. All right, Jonathan, Tom Glavin, box number six. Mr. Word, box John six. Word, box number six. All right, let's see what we get here. Box number six goes to Mr. Word. And I think in the 25 day from the National, or yeah. maybe it was that afterwards. Was that the na that we handed John's card in, or was uh, that he afterwards? Had a couple of... Chrome autos um, go in at Philly, I think, and then the Robles go in at the National. I don't know. I don't, I've got all the paperwork in the safe, right. yeah. so I'll, I'll take a look at it then. Top of my head, okay, I think that so, was it. so I will so tell I will tell everybody there. this, right? I saw my my uh, bill, my uh, my credit card bill from PSA today, um, or actually yesterday, but I looked at it today. Um, there were six or seven cards that they bumped from $27 to $100 for grading fees. Yeah, That's good news. It's great news. But we don't know whose cards they were. Right. We'll see when they get back. I will know when they get back. They, I'm hoping I get this batch back by Saturday. Um, but they, they bump some. Mm -hmm. I think I know one. Um, I had told when he, when he handed uh, it in. Chris missed his box. What was the box for? Oh, let's, let me give, uh, John, hold one second, buddy. Um, I think it was, um, I think it was one of my favorites, uh, but yeah, we'll, man, we'll do this right? again. Oh, yeah. I didn't want oh, you to sorry. tell him. That's okay. Yeah. And it is, uh, Dennis Eckersley, yeah. um, nice. which is great. And I was talk I was just talking about how he loves, I don't know if he loves it, but he freely talks about the home run that he gave up to Kirk Gibson. And, you know, maybe if Eckersley didn't have an MVP Cy Young World Series rings, maybe he wouldn't maybe feel, a more bitter about right, it. right. If he was like the Buffalo Bills. Right. Maybe he wouldn't Maybe like, like to uh, talk about Ricky it. Ricky Henderson is very proud to be Nolan Ryan's 5,000. Yeah, seconds. okay, yeah, something like that. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. So there you go, Chris. Dennis Eckersley. John's um, like this. Yeah, John's like, can you open my box? <laughs> yeah, we got it. We got it happening. But we do have... Um, very nicely wrapped box. There. Very nicely. But we do have, like I said, six or seven. I couldn't tell by my bill. Six or seven cards that got bumped. Which means that their value went from Which means their value is to, over... Well... They'll seven. give they'll give you some leeway between right. that five and seven fifty. So, we'll so this means those enough. cards shot up to about eight hundred to over a thousand dollars a piece. Mm -hmm. And we because don't know what their grades. Yes. Yep. Because their grades and were we'll, so good. Yep. Um, good we had some FP Jeters in the batch, we had some Mike Trout updates in the batch, yep. we had some Nolan Ryan rookies, we had um Yeah. We had could, yeah, I think I think right I know grade. one of them and yeah. I kinda gave Bob the warning. Right. Bob Leatherman. Right. I gave him the warning that the 56 mantle. mantle that he was handing in, unless it was a three, they're bumping it. Yeah. And I, I think, I'm pretty sure that's one that did get bumped, because I, I warned him before that. Yeah, um, Chris, thank you, Chris. Good, uh, look at this. There you go, John. Uh, Al Kaline, 10 gold gloves. On a gold glove. On a baseball. gold glove baseball. Not a bad ball. I like that one. And look at, look at his, look at the penmanship. That is nice. Because most athletes print, like, seven-year-olds. Yes. <laughs> Alkaline. Alkaline. 
Yeah, yeah. we were he's, talking about the battery. Alkaline. He should, he should have had a battery endorsement deal. Yes, he should. Yeah. He might have. Right. We don't know he didn't. Yeah, I don't know. Right? I don't. Back in the 60s, we don't know that he didn't. Or maybe in the late 50s. Um, so John's there we go, John. Um, Alkaline. Yep. 17. And now we have seven, Kevin Eckel. Uh, Kevin's on a heater. Kevin, right? Yeah, Kevin, Am I right? Kevin's feeling good. Kevin, don't, don't walk away from Don't get up from a heater. All right. So Kevin, I didn't show up. That's box number seven. Chris, Another. Did you say your name right? Voxakis? I wasn't that trying matter. that. Yeah. I wasn't trying that. Please all fall over his son. His son. Who did we just pull out? Al um, Line. Okay. There you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Guy, yep. That would make sense. Yes, it would. Yes, it would. Cool. Okay, so Kevin at box Rough number seven, seven a nicely wrapped. Yeah, this one's good. Uh, gets Brooks Robinson. Brooksy. There's Brooks. I have a feeling it'll be a Christmas gift, yeah. Brooks Robinson. Yeah, I bet Kevin's got a Brooksy. Uh, he has to have a Brooksy. Kevin, uh, HOF, nice Brooksy, though. Yeah, big signature. Yep, nice HOF 83. Out, not all, yep. uh, great looking signature. Oh, did I mention all this is JSA authenticated? Oh, yeah. Yeah. JSA authentication. There we go. Now we're talking. Now we're too bad John Word can't come up for this yeah. one. Yeah. Yeah, come on, John. <laughs> Um, so we've started this annual trip where we go to Charlestown, right? And we, yep. among other things, we bet on football, Yeah. right? Just bet on football. We take games. a just so everybody's safe. We take a limo bus out there, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and we have a blast. Yeah. And maybe a little blackjack at halftime. Yep, right? Oh, we story. have a great time. Well, we can promise the casino's an hour plus away, and you, yep. by the time you get there, you got a bus. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. And it's like not, and you leave it. We're leaving at around ten, right? Yeah. Go to Raphael's, Good have time. some breakfast, and then mm -hmm. hit the road. Okay. All right. Um, so Brandon Black, number eight. So is uh, Brandon a um, first time? I believe so. Okay. All right, Brandon. All right. First time, we... long time. And then we'll call the radio station. Long time listener is a long time first. Long time listener, first time caller. Yeah, that would be it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I thought you were saying something else, but what do you think I was saying? I nothing. Oh, I know what you think I was saying already. All right. So, um, Brandon Black, box number eight. We'll leave it at that. Yeah, I know. Yeah. And Ivan Rodriguez, Hall of Fame, seventeen, on a Hall of Fame Hall baseball. Of fame, Great. That's a nice one. Yeah. Hall of Fame, seventeen. Ivan Rodriguez. Pudge. Mike from Brandon. Congrats. Congrats, Brandon. Paul. All right. We have buddy Paul Guzzo. Paul Guzzo, box number nine. I thought of somebody else that might want to get on the limo bus. Did you? Mm-hmm. Who'd you got? John Purcell out there watching. Purcell out there. John Purcell, are you out there? He's probably out of town. He's always traveling. He's always traveling. Paul Guzzo, number nine. And number nine, Orlando Cepeda, won a Hall of Fame baseball, signed on the sweet spot, HOF 99. Good looking Cepeda signature. Good Cepeda signature. With uh, JSA authentication, great Cepeda. Did I say the next mystery box is really going to be good? I haven't yet. I don't think. It's if you did, I wasn't listening. It's really going to be good. Everybody be watching for this. So here we have Joe Morgan, but we don't have a Joe Morgan ball on the list, correct? Yeah, correct. Okay. <laughs> I, I always wanted Joe Morgan to pull Joe Morgan. I don't know why. But there's a Joe Morgan, box number 10. And thank you, Chad, for taking care of the limo bus for the second year in a row. Yeah. You can call Chad a lot of things, but cheap isn't one. No! Of cheap is the last thing you can call Chad. <laughs> and we have Roberto Alomar. Bobby Alomar. Another Hall of Fame baseball. Hall of Fame 2011. Roberto Alomar. All these are great looking signatures. And there's the Hall of Fame baseball. Signed on the sweet spot. Roberto Alomar. There you go. And Halfway through. that went to... Um, uh, Joe, Morgan. Joe Morgan. Yep, Joe Morgan. Two second baseman. Blake um, Promister, number Blake 11. Blake and Blake hit hard. Blake 
jumped in with three. Yep, and then he's got three out of ten here. Thirty percent chance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even think about that. And we're on the other we're on the other side of the fence here. That's right. That's right. Did I mention to keep posted for the next mystery box? Okay. It's gonna be a good one. Kind of hinted about it last week. Okay. Oh yeah. Blake, number 11 in this beautifully wrapped box. And number 11 is Cal Ripken. Go Cal Ripken. Cal. Cal Ripken. Mr. 2131. Iron Man Cal Ripken goes... Mr. 2632, if anything. Ah, there you go. Yeah, Iron Man. Yeah. Blake. Blake, Cal Ripken. Kevin Eshelman, um, Kevin Eshelman again. <coughs> Box number 12. Thank you, Blake. Thank you, Kevin. Thank everybody for participating in their mystery boxes tonight. And here we go with Kevin. Uh, box number 12. And box number 12 is Don Sutton. Don Sutton. Hall of Fame 98. Don Sutton. 300, 300 wins. wins. Exactly. <laughs> Exactly, Don Sutton. So, um, I was going to say something I forgot. All right. I did. Move on. Maybe it'll come back. It might. Yeah. Vincent Brooks. Vincent Brooks. The Perry new Hall new store. Could be a new one. That's not one I recognize. So thank you, Vincent. Welcome. There we go. And all Vince, right. I guess I, want, I hate being all proper and kind of the full name on. I know. Name. I know. I know. Could you say Vinny? I could. I'm sure he doesn't go by Vincent. Right. Unless it's like his mom and she's upset. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, Vincent Brooks. Yeah. Well, there's a middle name in there, too. Somewhere, right. All right. All right. Um, Brought you into this world, I'll take you out. That's what she says. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see what we got happening here. Look at that. On, Doesn't he know we're live right I now? Come on. This isn't a call-in show. Bro. I know. <laughs> Jeez. Um, very nice. Really hard to do one. <laughs> Johnny Bench. Johnny yeah. Bench, HOF 89. So, we had the man, we have the mantle in here, okay? And... He wants to know when the uh, next, uh, Within the next couple of days. Well, yeah. You'll post, you'll post uh, mystery box announcement coming soon. Yep. We'll, and that means the next yeah, so, day so basically, is when the post is. Um, let me, uh, we'll give me till Friday to get some things together. Yeah. All right. We'll, we'll, Friday. we'll, we'll put on there um, on Friday mystery box announcement coming soon. So probably Saturday afternoon is when they get we will actually post them. Yes. Yep. Do I have Dave here Saturday? Um, yes, because you don't have Bob. So it's okay. Okay. So I have Colin. Dave here. So me and Dave will get it up on um, Saturday. Yes, on yeah. Saturday. Johnny Bench. And that went to Vincent, right? What's up, Marty? Happy birthday. Martino! Happy birthday to you. All right. I was going to let you keep going by yourself. No, no. I was going to say, oh. yeah. <laughs> All right, Martino. All right. So uh, Johnny Bench goes to Vincent. And we are at box number 13. 14. That was 13. So we're at 14, Mr. Yep. Dan. Durr? Oh shoot, that's right. Um, <coughs> the it's um. I said we're leaving from rafts. Yeah, we're leaving from here. We're leaving from here. At ten. So if we're doing <laughs> rafts. Do that at nine, yeah. and then get here by ten. We'll be here at nine forty-five because the bus leaves at ten. Yes. That's right. Yeah, I got Scott who just said he's trying to make it. Cool. Um. Yep. All right, but he remind he did say he did remind me from the don't miss the bus. He told me because yeah, yeah, yeah. it's moving. Wouldn't it be bus. something if it left from my store and I missed the bus? I have a feeling they'd call or swing down. All right, Dan Durr. Up. There we <laughs> go, Dan. All right, box number fourteen goes to Dan Durr. Yes, That's yep, right. yes. 9.45, not a minute later. All <laughs> right, Dan Durr. What, what number are we on? 14? 14. 14. Okay. Box number 14 is oh, Mickey Mantle. Box number 14. Board. We've got yes. a Mickey Mantle ball going to Dan Durr. And I think that this is 
the, maybe the first time that Dan has done this? It might be. Beginner's maybe luck? If, if, if it's not the first Dan, time. Dan, are you, Dan, Dan you watching out there, buddy? You just got a five, six hundred dollar Mickey Mantle baseball for ninety nine dollars. sweet. Mickey Mantle autograph yeah, baseball. Dan. Sweet spot. Full letter of authenticity. I got to get my crowd going again, you know? What do you mean? That, my crowd. Oh, your noise? Yes. Your noise sound effect? Yes. Why, I, you know? Yeah. That's too late now. It is too late. Yeah, there's, by the time, the moment's lost. Oh, man. But All right, well, Dan. anyway, not for Danny. Danny. He's gonna... Boom, that's right. that's right. Mickey Mantle, autographed baseball. How awesome is that? Late. And that went number 14. Yep. To Dan Durr. It's all about man. Never gets old. Doesn't get old. It never gets old. <laughs> it doesn't never get old. All right, so box number 15 goes to Blake, and this nicely wrapped cube Who's got it? has uh, Robin, Robin Yount. Yount. Robin Yount. Very nice. Do you still wrap them up that? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Hall of Fame 99. I bet he does. Nicely signed like on the a sweet spot. Boom. All right. Lisa. We're going to box number 16. Lisa. All right, Lisa. Let's see what we have here. You seen who's left? Yeah, there's some good ones left. Yeah. Have Frank we pulled Robinson. Carlton Fisk? Uh, Frank Robinson? No Fisk. No Frank. No Palmer. No Mash. Is that it? No, there's one more. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Um, yeah, box number uh, 16 goes okay, to box. Lisa. Okay. Yeah. And box number 16 has Jim Six? Palmer. Yeah, not only does he have the mustache, still, Jim but it's Palmer. A man too. That's, that's right. Jim Palmer with Hall of Fame 90, or as he likes to write, Hall of Fame dot 9 dot. 9 dot. Right. right. <laughs> Hall of Fame 90, Jim Palmer. All right. Have I said I'm, I'm starving right now? I'm no, really hungry. No. I am hungry. I agree with you on that. Yeah, I am hungry. Mr. Word, All right, John 17. Word, number 17. So, I, I remember when, uh, what, never mind, I don't want to. What, what were you going to say? What boxes did John ask for originally, what numbers? And I knew one of them was gone already. It wasn't 14, was it? No. Okay, good. No, that's it was. Um, I probably shouldn't have even brought that up at all. I, so I asked for one. It was two, you know, seven. I, John, which one was it, buddy? It I don't was. remember which one it was. We could go back and look. I just, yes, uh, we could. Yeah, you know, for his sake. <laughs> Hope it wasn't fourteen. Uh, Bill Mazeroski. Bill Mazeroski who hit that famous home run. Walk off the only walk off home run in Game Seven of the World Series. Really? Yeah. Yeah. The only one. And the only other home run to walk off the series was to Joe Carter. But it wasn't game seven. But it did walk off the series. Yeah. Okay. Because today's actually the anniversary and, of Joe Carter doing it. Oh, I gotcha. Okay. So there's uh, Bill Mazeroski going to John, 7 and 17. Okay. That's uh, okay. Bill number so two. Okay. All right. Fine. So, okay. um, so John, I, does John have yeah, this up for trade? Mazeroski? Does he have this up for trade? Yeah. I would bet. Okay. Um, this hit uh, Matt, number 18. So Matt, number 18. Oh, Matt. Mazeroski. Today is, I guess John's got to say it's up for trade. We can't today play. is what, Wednesday? Uh, it's Wednesday. Okay. You know what Jimmy would say if he was here? Would say don't. It. We don't need that. <laughs> All right, Matt. Number 18. <laughs> number 18. Jimmy's not here, He's okay? Not here. So we don't right. need to hear it. 18 and number 18 is Carlton Fisk. Uh, World Series ball, right? Is is it? Is that? Oh, very nice. Or is it a Comiskey? It's ball? a Comiskey Comiskey, ball, Comiskey no, Park it. inaugural ball. Yeah. Very he did because he played for the White Sox. Right. Carlton Fisk. It's his second pudge. Right. 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 Ah, yeah. two pudges. That's two right. Pudges. That's right. <laughs> Good one. Mm -hmm. All right, so there's um, right. I'm, I'm somewhat there. <laughs> you're um, all right. So now we go to Chuck, Chuck. at number 19, Chuck. Chuck Gillis. Uh, 
Or no, we're not. <laughs> All right. 19. No, what number you Yeah, they're all number 19. Yes, who is that? Uh, number 13. Okay. Um, number 13 Vincent with Brooks. Vincent Brooks. Vincent. But we, didn't we review that with Vincent? No. No, it was Chris. Oh, the, okay, you're right. Hold on, we're checking right now. Um, Johnny Bench. Johnny, Johnny Bench. Bench. Nice one. With the HOF and Scripton. Right. All right, we got callers. Just tell me if it's male or not. We have That's people calling <laughs> in. All right, so we're going to um, Chuck. Number 19, number 19 goes to Chuck, nicely wrapped, um, and number 19 is Wade Boggs, so you yeah, boss hog, Wade Boggs with the 1985 AL batting champ inscription, that's pretty cool, what did he bat, like 360, stop boy, what did he bat, like 360 that year, 1985, it could be. It could be. Better one in ten chance, right? But it was up there. Yeah, it was way right up there. Right on the oh, come on. 1985 works. AL batting champ, Wade Boggs. That's a cool Wade Boggs autographed baseball. And it's an older signature. You can tell because it's not as slanted and squishy. 368. 368. It's not as slanted and squishy. Look at that. Like, look at the Boggs. Oh, yeah. You know? Great print. Too. You never Great read print. Boggs. In today's world, yeah. when he signs it, you don't read Boggs. But th I bet this ball was probably signed in the 90s. I'm going with it. Because that's an America, official American League baseball. Yeah. All right. Good job. Chuck. And then Blake closing us out. Blake at number 20. And I know who he has. And it's a vintage signature on a vintage ball. And it is. Frank, right? Yes. And we have the Frank Robinson. Um. There you go. The full signature of Frank Robinson, which you don't see very often, right? Right. It's the vintage. Or an official. Laces. Yep. And on the side of the ball. Official American League nice Baseball. Time. Look at that. There you go, Blake. Uh, John Word popped it right off. Yeah. 368 in 1985. Did you know that, John, or did you Google? I, I have to know that. He probably knew. He should be saying Yeah. Yeah, well, I knew it was 360 it, right? something. And he batted 366 you know? two years later to lead the league. Wow. Lead the league of what was his lifetime batting lifetime. average? 320 something, I bet. Um, okay. Yeah, we need to know that. Um, all right, everybody. Thank you very much. Didn't mean to go fast tonight. It just happened that way. 328 lifetime average. Three something. So That's in in uh, in 1987 or 88. <laughs> Pretty good. Um, Bob's was, you know, of course, batting 360, um, the baseball yeah, reference. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So, so Wade Boggs was batting 360s. <laughs> um, what did you say? In 85, you batted what, you know, 85, 368, 86, 357, 87, 363, 88, 366. So over a four-year okay. span, he batted 360. So That's in 89, crazy. what did he bat? 330. Exactly. Like fell off. What did he bat in 90? Okay, there it is. In 19, and he was catching heat because he wasn't hitting home runs. How many home runs did he have in 1990? Uh, like they were giving him crap because he was hitting 340. Yeah. 350. Okay. Now, one year he went off and he popped off like 20 home runs. That was his average. 87, 24 his home average runs. fell. 20, but what did his average? 363. Uh, 360. Wow. Yeah, that's. Uh, wow, yeah. I, I can't. His lowest year was 92. He Boom. only batted 259. That's crazy. Yeah, and so he batted 360 yep. plus. Over what was his lowest year? Span. That's insane. Uh, 259 and 92. And how many home runs did he hit that year? Um, maybe he seven. Was seven. Okay, maybe he was hurt or something. But I just remember, and I remember in the 1987 All Star he game. With the Rays. When he was, didn't he in the night. In the Rays. Uh, 280 and 301. He played two years. Two years. Yeah. 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 And at the end of his career, the end of his he still career. 300. Yeah, he only had one, two. Three, maybe three seasons that he batted under 300. And he yeah. ate chicken before every game. Yeah, yeah fried chicken. Fried chicken. Man. So, um, winner, winner, chicken dinner. That's right. So in 1987, I remember watching the All Star game, and Wade Boggs and Bo Jackson went back to back home runs. That was pretty cool. And we have somebody like Wade Boggs that he's batting first or second, you know, and Bo Jackson right behind him. And this is when Wade Boggs is batting 360, mm -hmm. and you had then you had Bo and what he was doing. Yeah. All right, so, um, but 
again, um, thank you, everybody. Uh, didn't mean uh, we weren't rushing. We just it just rolled this way tonight, where we finished up in about 35 minutes, right? Yeah. Well, we went on five minutes early too. Yeah. Right. Get right. So out of the yeah, way. yeah, yeah, we did, we did do that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. Um, all right. So um, again, great man with sportscards.com is where you can get your mystery boxes. Um, it looks like looks like Friday we'll we'll post the announcement coming soon, and then uh, Saturday I'm excited about I'm really excited about this one. It's, it's a good one. It's a good. It's a, it's a strong one. It's a strong. One. It's a 20 box run. Mm -hmm. I will say that. So yeah. you know what takes out a play there, because it's only a 20 box no, right. run. It's not 23 or no no no. It's, it's not 100. It's not 100. Oh, it's, okay. not 100. it's not 100. It's not 100 boxes. So I that. but I am ex really excited about this next one. Uh, because it's a it's a wide variety of items, mm. and a lot of new items mm. coming in. Yeah. Not a lot of duplicates of what we've had in the past. Right. And we've never had this headliner in the past. Right. Never had this headliner. Um. So everybody be watching for that. My guess would be uh, around. Saturday, right? Yeah, about two o'clock. Yeah, go with two. One thirty, something like that. We're gonna post that video oh, so and um, giving Saturday. everybody here a heads up. Uh, to it's to my go. I get what, to sleep in on Saturday. What, what did you say that's, about what? Uh, that's about what time I plan on waking up Saturday. One thirty, two uh, o'clock. Uh, I'm just saying, uh, I couldn't do that. <laughs> I would be so depressed if I woke up. At yeah, you would. You would. <laughs> like, oh, now I can't do anything today. <laughs> yeah, you would. <laughs> so again, right. be watching for our announcement. Be watching for our uh, theme post. Um, what was it? Wow. Looks like he only struck yeah. out more. Bob only struck out more than he walked once. And that was when he was 40. Wow. I did not look at that set. That's impressive. Yeah. Mm. All right. Uh, great moment, sportscars.com. Thank you, everybody. Have a great evening, and we will see you. I will see you Saturday when I announce the uh, theme, and then we'll be doing them next Thursday again? Yeah, we're back to Thursday, oh, right? We're doing the auction for, um, Bozeman Tuesday. for Mr. Bozeman uh, at his foundation uh, on Tuesday night. Tuesday. So, so Thursday, we'll, so see we'll do Thursday. I will say this: if we sell out fast, we'll pop like a card thing in there or something. Yeah, maybe right? We'll do two we, Thursday, right, huh? right. If we sell out of this one Double fast, which I really think we're gonna do, we'll maybe we'll pop a card, you know, okay. autograph slabbed cards or Perez Steel or JSA cards or whatever. So, yep. so everybody, thank you very much. Have a good evening. I'm going to get some dinner. Uh, have fun tonight. Take care. See you guys. Bye.